hello students uh, so let me discuss about the study plan for uh, gate 2023 okay so what are all the uh, things which you need to take care of and uh, what should be the basic plan okay how you need to start your preparation how you need to proceed what should be the preparation process and what should be the ending strategy also those are the things which we are uh, going to discuss in detail okay so uh, before starting the video itself uh, a weekly plan okay that schedule will be attached to the course okay uh, in the gate 2023 course you can just go through that weekly plan okay so i will talk about that weekly plan but overall first let us uh, discuss about the study plan and then in between i will talk about the weekly plan also i am dividing this particular uh, uh, study plan into two phases okay one is the initial phase another one is final phase basically i am giving this study plan for both uh, me and xe okay right xe xe a b e uh, a b d and e okay fine so the plan is something like this okay initial pace okay my uh, like initial pace and then final pace there will be two pace one is initial pace another one is final pace in initial pace you have to deal with these things weekly plans concept solve problems are rq gate P pyq main notes short notes star mark questions update short notes topic test and subject test and practice questions i will talk about each and everything in detail and in final phase you have to deal with complete revisions and uh, full length mock test revise and which you need to revise and updating the short notes okay and then what are all the must do's okay and what are the must do's and what are the things which uh, very less cared of okay by the student the students who are preparing for gate these are the things which they are caring very less okay and these are the things which is going to decide your rank also okay which is going to completely decide your uh, final uh, gate exam okay so but these are the things which less cared among the students okay even i have seen number of number of students who are not taking care of these things properly okay and of course i will talk about the live lectures and test series so start with first uh, regarding weekly plan if you open our gate 2023 course okay you will have a weekly plan okay how it is going to be week 1 okay if you are starting this is your first week suppose if this is your first week then for that first week that particular week what topics you need to cover what videos you need to cover okay for example calculus and vector calculus this will be your first week schedule as, as per the schedule this will be your first week schedule differential calculus integral calculus and vector calculus and how you need to cover this simple first go through all the videos you need to go through differential calculus videos and uh, if, if it's like if you want you go through all the three chapters videos uh, in a stretch but my recommendation or it depend on it depends on the student one is either you go through the complete differential calculus videos after completing that come for uh solved problems and rrqs will be there in the video itself okay, it will be there in the video itself so you can just go through that solved problems and rrq and the concepts videos will also be there okay so basically this me plus xc course will have uh, pre recorded videos plus live lecture we already we, we already know that right i have discussed about it in earlier videos also so these things are the pre recorded videos the schedule which given to you is for the pre recorded videos for the live lecture when the live lecture will happen that schedule will be given to you later in the month of june okay right so concept solved problems and rrq of that particular chapter differential calculus completed then go for gate previous previous year questions gate previous year questions of that particular uh chapter if it is a calculus that that alone okay or else you don't want to do that then what i will suggest go through entire week syllabus such as differential calculus integral calculus and vector first week go through the entire week syllabus which means go through entirely go through the entire concepts entire solved problem entire rrq of that particular uh, week's schedule after going through it do all the gate previous year questions of that particular week but never skip doing gate previous year question if if some subject some topic is allotted for you in that particular week that topics gate previous year question should be done in that week itself you should never postpone that to the next week okay never do that if it is calculus vector calculus for the first week after completing concepts that is after completing concept videos solved problem videos rrq videos you need to do gate previous year questions okay similarly week 2 Hmm. 
engineering mechanics okay some some two chapters or three chapters you need to go through concept video solved problem video rrq video and then complete the gate previous equations of whatever all the topics what are the topics which you studied kinematics of particles kinematics of uh, uh, rigid bodies free body diagram etc those topics for those topics you need to go through that and then you need to go through the previous equations gate previous equations right now next what you need to do you need to make a main notes main notes are nothing but the notes which you are going to make after going through the video okay, after going through the video what are the notes you are going to make and uh, the solved problems and rrq which is present in the uh, video whatever is whatever i am saying in the video you are going to replicate it in your main notes and then short notes okay and then short notes you could see that i have written short notes in the must do step this is something which many students own do okay but it will affect you okay, it will affect you what is short note how to prepare i have made a separate video i will keep it in that in this list itself after this video you will able to see the short notes video also okay so you need to prepare main notes the main notes are nothing but the notes which you are directly taking from the videos fully and short notes how to prepare i will be giving you a separating and this main notes and short notes should also be completed in that week itself if you are come if you are preparing calculus uh, differential calculus integral calculus and vector calculus main notes and short notes should also be done in that week itself you should never skip it to next week okay fine now star mark questions what is the star mark question suppose if you are solving gate previous equation some you are solving some 100 questions let us suppose but in that 100 questions some 5 or 6 questions you are not able to solve at the first attempt or 10 or 20 questions whatever whatever may be the number of questions you are not able to solve it at the first attempt those questions are trouble uh, troubling you so those are trouble makers what do you need to do mark it star mark it and keep it separately why it is uh, why that star in what that star indicates those are the questions which is trouble maker for you so that i can come back to that question and revise it later during your revision period maybe during your uh, periodical revision period or maybe during your final revision also okay instead of going through all the previous year question only you can go through the star marked question okay so you need to mark the questions which is uh, which is which you are not able to solve at the first attempt and now after going through video solved problems and rrq you will get some main notes right and short notes also you would have prepared but after going through gate previous year question you might get some one or two new points not not very much but you will get some new points you might get some new theory points for example if it's a manufacturing engineering you will get some theoretical theoretical points okay what you need to do take it and update it okay take it and update it in short notes whatever the points you are getting through problem solving Okay, through problem solving, whatever the additional concept, additional formulas, additional theory points, whatever you are getting through problem solving, update it in short notes. Without updating, you will forget. Just you will solve the problem and you will forget after ten minutes. But if you solve the problem and if you learn what is the new thing which is present in the problem and if you update it in the short notes, when you are revising that short notes, you will able to recollect it. Okay, so that is the fifth step. and i won't say it as a step these are the things you need to do okay in the initial phase and once the test series start uh, that is once the test series was uh, once we start giving test series for example in the month of uh, uh, april from the month of april uh, test series will get get started so the, if you are registered for the gate 2023 course you will get everything you don't need to buy it again test series will also be included in the course so test series will be start will start from april okay so from the month of april okay from the month of april you will start you will able to write test okay you don't have to uh, what i could say after that uh, i will i will give an example for example uh, you have completed some two subjects okay you completed two subjects you are dealing with the third subject and uh, presently we are we have started to launch the test for example engineering max uh, test was available uh, some uh, mechanics fluid mechanics test was available so if the test is available and if you completed the topic of that particular test then and then i will say that once you go through that once you revise it what are the topics you completed once you revise it then go and write the test and that should happen uh, in that initial phase itself okay in that initial phase itself from april month okay after completing mathematics if test is available write it if test is not available just wait maybe some 10 days or 15 days it will be available then you write it okay if you completed a topic and if test is available immediately write if the test is not available maybe if, if it takes some 2 weeks or 3 weeks after 2 weeks or 3 weeks you write it once revise the topic and write it that's it so subject test and topic test should be done when you are in the initial phase itself 
that is when you are preparing initially that time itself only full length mock test you need to go for the you need to uh, plan for the final base okay uh, so topic test and subject test and finally practice sessions these sessions will happen uh, will happen every week okay every week it will happen sometimes it will happen two times like two times every week okay how it is going to happen what are the steps and uh, how you how you are going to attempt i have made a separate video about it i will attach that video also you go through it okay fine so these are the things which you have to do for the initial base okay and don't forget it periodical revision very important very important for example you completed calculus and vector calculus week 1 you starting engineering mechanics in week 2 then whatever you completed in week 1 that has to be revised okay some one hour daily daily one hour has to be invested for the topics which you completed in week 1 now moving forward to week 2 sorry week 3 you are continuing with engineering mechanics some other topics now whatever you completed in week 1 and week 2 you need to plan it for week 3 also some one hour or one of us so in the same manner as you are proceeding in each and every week the topics which you completed in the earlier week has to be revised back that is a key point and again a must to do because many of them many students are not doing it see i am stressing it like something especially short notes and periodical revision i'm stressing it like something because number of students have failed uh, like when it comes to gate exam number of students have not failed after going and attempting the exam they have failed during their preparation itself because of their preparation mistake itself and these two are key preparation mistake very very important key mistake okay so again regarding periodical revision also i will attach a video you go through it what detail detail video about periodical revision okay ha huh. so final formula sheet see once you done with the initial phase which means you have completed all the week schedule okay and also let me talk about the live lecture during this week itself okay during the week schedule itself live lecture will start from june okay most probably may end or june okay may end in june and when the live lecture starts how the live lectures are planned so for example let us suppose may 21st okay i'm i'm giving you may 21st uh 6 pm okay uh, live lecture one that live lecture one will happen on the topic vector calculus uh, differential calculus and integral calculus i said to you what does it mean i'm not going to cover you the concepts again and i won't solve the problems which are already there in the uh, uh, recorded videos whatever there in the recorded videos i will expect you to go through everything before coming to the live lecture when you reach live lecture suppose the live lectures of calculus was there you should have already completed the uh, what is that you should have already completed the concepts the previous year question and also the questions uh, which is uh, what is that the questions uh, the questions which is solved in the videos after that you come for live lecture and in live lecture i will be doing some additional problems from the topics which is mentioned i hope you got it and in live lecture whatever you are doubt you are what are the doubts you are getting that will be solved in that live lecture itself it will be interactive uh, most probably it will happen in zoom or google meet so that you can communicate itself you can directly communicate that is you can talk instead of commenting you can talk okay um yeah so that is why it will be interactive interactive between a student and the faculty right student and the teacher right so that is about uh, live lecture right and that live lecture will also be included in that initial phase itself okay so once you complete this initial phase once if you enter into final phase your your syllabus your basic problems uh, subject test practice session and what else topic test and uh, short notes main notes everything should have been done everything should have been done now before going into final phase you should prepare a final formula sheet or a formula chart again regarding this formula sheet formula chart also why it is necessary i have made a video i will attach that video also after this okay so you go through it now this formula sheet and uh, uh, formula sheet and uh, formula chart you need to make it before going for full length mock test so what you have to do after completing the initial phase before going for the final phase revise everything your main notes your star mark questions your short notes your updated short notes revise everything 
and write down the formulas see you don't need to write down basic formulas and all density is equal to mass by volume no not needed okay write down the formulas which you feel you will forget very easily okay so that you can recollect it again and again write it stick it before your study table okay right similarly this weekly plan also uh, you will able to download it download it stick it before your study table once after completing each topic you can just give a tick mark and then you can proceed okay so download the weekly plan and stick it before the study table okay so so complete revision take a formula sheet formula notes and once after making this formula chart go for a mock test and after writing mock test if you are getting less mark or uh, more mark or intermediate mark whatever don't worry re revisit it analyze the mock test whatever you are able to learn newly again update it in your short notes again update it in your short notes so again go for that again update it go for it update it it should happen the optimization should happen until the last minute of your gate exam okay and uh, when it comes to mock test the main important thing is how you are going to improve your accuracy at the same time not losing your time accuracy is important very important at the same time you need to make sure you are in an optimized time and with the same gate exam environment that is our ultimate aim when it comes to mock test okay that should be your plan more learning should happen in topic and subject wise test that should be in your initial phase final phase you have to correct yourself you have to correct your uh, uh timing okay the time which you taken for solve the questions and uh, uh accuracy okay and how to use the gate calculator of course even in the subject and topic test also you need to use your gate calculator which will be present in in our website okay if you are uh, using our test series it will be present and yeah but the major correction should be done in that mock test because 3 hours 65 questions you will able to do it perfectly and now revision that is when you are revising the problems okay when you are revising the problems revise all the star mark questions revise all the critical questions in test series suppose if you if you find out some questions are critical you bookmark it revise it again okay you bookmark it you revise it again at the end okay and as usual updation of short notes should happen until end okay so that's it okay that is your uh, detailed plan okay how you should start your preparation and how you should end your preparation and also how live lectures will happen and uh, how test series will happen okay all the things has been discussed in detail and we have separate group right so most of you would have joined that is the registered students of course registered for registered students you have uh, we have separate gr group for gate and me course we have a separate group and for each and every subject mathematics fluid mechanics uh, production for each and every subject we have a separate group you will get added into that group once after registration and whatever the doubts you are getting in the uh, videos pre recorded videos you can post in that and how to use the doubt group effectively for that also i have a separate video i will attach that also in this okay so that's it okay any doubt any queries you can uh, you can ask us okay so you can use whatsapp for asking your queries okay whatsapp is for asking your queries and telegram groups is for asking doubts in the uh, doubts in in the subject if you have doubt in a casting topic in production you need to post that doubt in that particular group in that particular production group okay don't ask in whatsapp okay whatsapps are whatsapp is only for uh, queries if there was any preparation related doubt if there was uh, a technical problem okay so then you can ask any doubt related to subject should be posted in that particular subject group only okay so that's it i hope the study plan and whatever the things we are going to do for this year will be very very helpful for the students and uh, i wish you very all the best uh, for this journey okay which is going to begin